Another week, another update for Bot Clash and it's amazing guys. I mean, hands up to the developer of this game from following his promise of weekly update. I wish Preston can do that and everyone will be so happy. Anyways, before we begin, I'm going to select now the winner from our previous video since we reached 100 likes guys. Thank you so much. And I'm going to use this website called Comment Picker. So let's go. Our winner is... Lock OMG! Hey bro, I like your videos and I would like to have a legendary. Well, there you go, bro. Congratulations. Please drop your user in this video so I can add you in game and give you your prize. Now for this video, I'm going to do another giveaway and this time guys, I'm giving away a 5-star legendary bot King Cobra. That's the new legendary from the new update if this video reach 100 likes. Which is insane guys because I use a total of 16 legendaries on this one just to make it a 5 star. So write in the comments below your username guys and like this video. Now back to the video guys, new update includes the new world called Desert Ruins with that includes the new bots as well. I've actually got a mythical bot already and it's called Selcat and I didn't get one or two but I actually got four of this mythical guys. Which is insane. How did I get this? Well, watch my previous video guys on how you can increase your chance of getting miracles. Anyways, it's basically a max scorpion kind of matching the desert team. And speaking of scorpion, we also have a new mech mount which is called mech scorpion. It's so funny because when I equip this one, the first thing that comes to my mind is the rock interpretations of scorpion king in the mummy movies. <laughs> Anyways, this one is gifted to me in exchange of gold coins and the reason why I want this is because of the passive that it gives which is 50% more coins, gems, and movement speed when you are in desert ruins. They also increase the maximum level of bots to level 150 which is insane because one of my bot now has almost 600 million damage guys and that's just for one bot. They also added the boost panel on the ability tab which is also an awesome addition because now you can see all the bonuses you have in the game. Another great addition is the mysterious boxes that spawn in random worlds from time to time and if you break it you have a chance to get an instant buff and gems. I just wish they didn't make the buff so instant because if you manage to get a lock you have no choice but to stop whatever you're doing and start hatching bots to maximize the time. Also if you don't have any coins and you are in the middle of farming and you got the lock buff then it's completely wasted because you can't hatch anything. Regardless though it's a great addition to the game and I hope they made a little tweak cause in other games like pet sim you can actually save your potion buffs so you can use them in the most convenient time. Other than that, they've added some new tier level to the last boss but most players don't even have enough damage to kill the last boss so it doesn't affect them that much. All in all guys, the bot clash update is an amazing update and I'm looking forward to more updates next week. If you haven't subscribed yet guys, please subscribe now. I'm trying to reach my goal of 10k and if I reach that, I'm going to do a giveaway of game passes via gift. So click that subscribe button now along with the notification bell. Thank you guys for watching and see you when I see you. Bye!